So, what is the <coughs> function of the voltage-gated sodium channels and what is the function of the potassium channels? Uh, the potassium channels are generally responsible for repolarization. Yes, they are relatively simple structures, so they are enable, uh, enable to getting the ions out of the cell. Yes, so uh, we have <coughs> high concentration of the potassium in, low concentration of potassium out. So when we open the channels, the potassium gets out. Simple like that. Uh, the voltage-gated sodium channels are a bit more complicated. To be honest, far more complicated. Uh, because they have a couple of structures that you can see uh, in the picture. For example, uh, first of all, they have channel inactivating segment. The channel inactivating segment is very important for it because it is able, as you can see here, to close the flow of the sodium ions. Uh, so, oh, okay. uh, so when the channel is open and when it's closed, uh, it has four states generally. Yes, it can be activated or inactivated, and then can be open or closed. Uh, so when does the ions flow? And, and when they do not flow. When, as you can see here, the ion channel is closed, yes, so those two uh, subunits are very close to each other and no space for the uh, sodium ions there is, yes, the ions cannot flow. Then when uh, the uh, voltage-gated sodium channels will open and they are activated, uh, the ion channel ions can flow. What does it mean that they activate it? They are activated when the channel inactivating segment is not in the channel. Simple like that. So here they are activated and here they are activated. And when the channel is open, yes, so uh, it does not look like that, yes? It looks like that. So this is open channel, this is open channel. Uh, and the channel inactivating segment is inside, it also would stop the flow of the sodium ions. Yes? So in order for the sodium ions to flow through the voltage-gated sodium channel, uh, the channel needs to be open and activated. If it's inactivated or closed or both, uh, oh, it's hard to get both, never mind. When it's inactivated or closed, the ions would not flow. Simple like that. Okay, thank you.